Hello and welcome to another episode of Laptop Retrospective and today we are going to be doing an SSD install on in this fantastic T430. There is an MSATA drive bay located in this machine and as you may or may not know some computers are is a very laborious process to do such an install depending on where they like to hide the drive bay. However, sometimes fast is fast. We are very fortunate to be in that ladder. So let's get right to it. Let's not waste any time. Look at that. Get that out of the way. There's our drive. Boom. Oh, I got some tape in my way. I don't think so. Get out of here. Oh no. We're done already. Sorry that didn't take as long, but what can you do? Anyway, if you enjoy this sort of, actually, no, hold on a second. I know that there's a lot of you that want to know more about this drive and not just how amazingly easy that installation was. So let's rewind and talk about this again. <laughs> Let's take a second to talk about this particular company. So this is actually on the box, it'll say uh, Dogfish Technology. It's actually three color Dogfish Technology. And this is a brand that has recently shown up on the North American market. Now, these uh, were mostly issued in partner with famous brands such as HP, Lenovo, and Dell, uh, but they haven't become a main uh, distributor until about 2007 where they became the main distributor of Kingston in China. That being said, it wasn't until uh, 2017 that they opened up to the international market. So if you have access to an Amazon or a Newegg in your country, these drives are actually becoming uh, more common and more available. And the price of these is too good not to investigate. To give you an idea, this is about half the cost of what I would expect to pay for a similarly uh, size drive from Samsung or Kingston or other brand names. Is it as good? Hard to say. They do, uh, I know, do some environmental testing with Flexstar Technologies, so their SSDs do go through some kind of um, quality control process. They do cover them with a three-year warranty. I'm looking at the stats, they do come uh, with similar read and write speeds of 540 uh, megs approximately up and down. So whether or not this drive uh, will be all that in a bag of potato chips, I, I'm actually pretty confident that it will uh, do the trick. So just a little bit of extra information about the drive just in case you were curious. All right, ladies and gentlemen, that being said, I hope you enjoyed the video and if you have any questions, please feel free to leave them in the comment section down below. Ask me on Twitter. Again, always appreciate a follower there. And uh, check me out on Curious Cat if you want to ask your questions anonymously. And as always, if this content has been helpful and you would like to see more of it, please hit that subscribe button and share the video with uh, your friends that might benefit from it, because that's how we will get this channel and our community to grow. And I'll see you next time.